I'm uh, Christopher Tooley. I'm Chief Executive Officer of Leica Mobile, uh, a global MVNO operator with the largest international MVNO in the world, operating in 21 countries with over 15 million customers and over 1.2 billion euros of re annual revenue. Well, I think the, the MVNO market is uh, maturing in Europe um, and it's starting to emerge in some of the what we call the frontier nations. Uh, besides Europe, it's maturing in the, the US market, um, in the Far Eastern markets, and in the Australian markets. But we're seeing growth in what we call emerging markets. Last year, we launched in Tunisia. Uh, this year, we're planning launches, um, further launches in Eastern Europe, in Macedonia, where we've just launched. We're also looking at uh, territories such as Turkey, North Africa, South America, and the Far East. So the future for MVNOs outside Europe and the mature markets is very strong indeed. Well, I think adapting to different regulatory regimes is one of the biggest challenges. Um, in many of the countries, you require to have local partners. You can't control uh, a majority of the business, so you need to find a strong local partner, or you need to really understand what you're getting into. Um, but what we're finding overall is that where you're not cannibalizing the base of the existing mobile operators, then the mobile operators will actually embrace you as an MBNO because they want to see the type of growth in MBNOs that we've seen in the Western markets in their own markets. Well, I think this has been a very interesting event in London. It's had a different flavour from before. We've had uh, regulators from, from uh, Brussels here. Um, I'm surprised some of them got out live, but they gave some very interesting presentations. We've heard a lot about why mergers have been either approved or disapproved in the last year or two, and it showed what a spate of consolidation has been or attempted consolidation at, uh, at MNO level. But it also showed me how the MNOs, who are represented here in good numbers, how they are... Um, embracing MVNOs and how, how they support MVNOs and see MVNOs as growth engines in the market whereas their own revenues are declining. So I think the MNOs are seeing MVNOs here to stay and that was good to hear at this conference. Well I think it's, it's a getting together of people who I personally have known in the industry for many many years now. I saw someone I was in business with 20 years ago at this uh, conference this morning. We barely recognized each other, but it was good to see them again. And it's good to see the community of people who work within the MBNO business um, you know, maturing, having successful careers in MBNO, and seeing the MBNOs uh, look like they're here to stay.